Hi guys, welcome back. This is Maths 3000. Today I'm going to go over the division law for powers. So the rule for dividing powers is to subtract the powers. Just make sure the numbers on the base are the same. So let's have a look at our first example. So we've got 8 to the power of 11 divided by 8 to the power of 4. So since we're dividing, we take the powers at the top away. So this will be 8 to the power of 11 take away 4. So 11 take away 4 is 7. So we get 8 to the power of 7. Let's do the second example. So we've got 11 to the power of 8 divided by 11 cubed. So that line means divide. So again, we're dividing, so we take the powers away. So keep that base number the same. So 8 take away 3 is 5. So we get 11 to the power of 5. So let's move on to example 3. So this time we've got m to the power of 12 divided by m to the power of 4. So again, our base is m. And we've got to take the powers away. So we do 12 take away 4 which is m to the power of 8. Let's have a look at example 4 then. This time I've got to simplify 12 to the power of 6 divided by 12. Now the power on the 12 here is 1. Okay, So we have to do 12 to the power of 6 take away 1, which gives us 12 to the power of 5. And our final example then, we've got x to the power of 5 divided by x to the power of 8. So again, keep the base letter the same. So this time we've got to do 5 take away 8. Whatever you do, don't change the order around. So keep it in that order. Don't do 8 take away 5. Okay, so 5 take away 8 will give us a negative 3. So it's fine having a negative power. So if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you next time, guys. Bye-bye.